What's up you son of a gun? My name is Ovik and today we're going to play an amazing game that I am enjoying so much. It's called Randall's Monday. I hope you're gonna enjoy it because we're gonna point and click everywhere. Let's do this. Alright. <laughs> I knew it. Most knew new it. fish come close to madness the first night. Somebody always breaks down crying. Happens every time. God damn the it. only question is, who's it gonna be? It's as good a thing to bet on as any, I guess. I had my money on Randy Hicks. Okay, so this is the famous hole. Hmm, okay. Step one, find a bar of soap. Step two, get the hell out of the stinky hole. Step three, get back home to old Marconi. God, I never thought I'd actually miss his stinky old ass. Okay, sponge. Bucket. Nah. I don't need to go right now. There's a piss bucket. Hold. Oh no, I'm not gonna stick my hand. Okay, let's see if we can put the sponge in the bucket. It's already soaked. I don't need to do that. Ew. If you find. If you. If you find. Yeah, I'll find this you... good. Shut the hell up. If you um no how about the soap uh, i mean the hole i'm not gonna clean mm -hmm. filthy wall hey hey looks like there's something written under all this filth okay now the wall's a little cleaner but i'm still not touching it Okay. Hmm. It says, I haven't seen Berlin yet, from the ground or from the air, and I plan on doing both before the war is over. Okay. I haven't reached the punching the wall stage yet. All in good time. Hmm. This wall doesn't seem to be as dirty as the other one. But still... I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna clean. I'm not gonna feed whatever it is that lives in there. Okay, let's see if it's already open. It's already open. I have food here. I'm not gonna feed whatever it is. Why? I have no. Re Hello. Is someone there? Can you hear me? Hello? 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 Silence, prisoner! Enough with the yelling! Murray? Shut your trap! What's all this racket? I'm detecting a distinct strain of resentment in your voice, Murray. My sympathy for you disappeared the moment you broke that bottle over my head. Oh, come <laughs> on, Murray. Don't be like that. It was just a one-time thing. It won't happen again, I swear. Of course not. The whole will make sure of that. I'm sorry? A little while in here will teach you to behave. What exactly do you mean by a little while? I mean a long time. What you did was very serious. The whole will teach you some manners. Murray, this place stinks. There's no room for cleaning in the hole. I see. And what do you think the Board of Health will think about that? Hmm, well... The hole, the hole. Are you just trying to scare me by saying the hole in every sentence? Don't you realize the trouble you're in? You're in the hole. Nothing will ever be the same again. People are thrown in the hole, and the hole psychologically destroys people. I told you to stay away from trouble. Okay, okay. Hmm... Hey, Murray, I think someone left a weird message down here on the wall. You mean like uh, some sort of secret message? Yeah, kind of. Um, it's signed by some Virgil Hiltz guy. Oh, hey, wasn't that the name of the guy Steve McQueen played in The Great Escape? Oh, that. Yeah, some time ago we had a prisoner who was totally obsessed with that movie. He <laughs> was always getting into trouble on purpose just so we would lock him up down here. And then, he would spend hours playing with that stupid ball. What a crackpot. And what became of him? 
Well, it looks like Sleazy managed to sneak him in a motorcycle. So, did he try and break out just like they did in the movie? Yeah, and just like in the movie, he ended up crashing his bike into the barbed wire fence. But unlike Steve McQueen, that guy didn't have any stuntmen. So it killed him. What a great story. I wish I had a ball too. Hmm, it would make all this a lot more bearable. Well, he left the ball here. You want it? Really? You'd do okay. that for me? If it shuts you up for a while. Go on, here. I have a ball! Give me the ball. The ball is mine. I got the ball. What do we do with the ball now? Should we I sponge don't think... it? Should we drag it? Think... Should we put food? I don't... I don't this? Think... Wait, can I put the... I'm not putting the... Wait, can I like take the ball with the hole? I don't think that's gonna work. Okay. Uh, ball with I this. Th ball with this. I don't... Ball with the measuring. I don't... I don't... I don't think that's... Ah, damn ball. You're no Wilson and you never will be. Okay. There's a measuring tape here. I don't need to measure. Now the wall's a little cleaner, but I'm... Hmm, it says, I haven't seen Berlin yet, from the ground or from the air, and I plan... Wait, wait, wait. I can put the wall... Ball on the wall. God damn it. That was cool. A few hours later. Hey. Oh, there is a crack in the wall. Yeah, I'm not the Hulk. But I have a crowbar. They left me in the hole with a I crowbar. I have no idea what's behind that wall. There could be some high voltage wires or something. I'm not risking it. What? Uh, sponge? I'm not good. Okay, how about we do a little bit more? A few hours later. Did you break it yet? God damn it, I broke it. I'm still... Ooh, the ball is making the wall crack. Okay. How about we do... I have no idea. Okay, that did not... Okay. Mm, let's do one more. <laughs> That's weird. Three is the charm. I heard something break. And... Great. I just broke the wall. Yep. And that's what we do. There's a nut. I can't loosen it with my bare hands. But you're the Hulk. Or he said no. Nut? Hey. Yeah. Oh, shit. The rat is out. Hey, the rat is dead. Look what we've got here. Looks like I just steam cooked my sneaky cellmate. <laughs> That's it's not hot. Bold rat. You touch a rat? There was a rat in the hole. I'm not gonna stick my hand in there. So what do we do with this now? I have I have Are we going to cook it? I have Eat it? I have Put it inside I this? Have, I have no idea. I have This is weird as shit. I have I have I have no what do we do with this? I have no... Okay. Can we place it in the bucket? Oh, Your shit. friends will always remember you. But now, rot. Uh oh. <laughs> 48 hours later? But it's a Monday. Damn. It smells like rotten meat in here. And it wasn't you. me, I swear. Hey, Murray, come here. I know you're still there. Okay. What now, prisoner? It reeks in here. This is inhumane. Come on, you gotta do something about this. I don't think it smells that bad. But here, have some soap. Just rub it you know where. 
I got some salt. Oh, that's not gonna do it. You have to get me out of here, Murray. Negative. The smell is a little unpleasant, I'll give you that. But this is not a spa, my friend. I'm afraid you'll just have to put up with it. God damn it! Filthy bucket. Oh, uh, no. I don't want anything. Okay, you don't want anything to do with the filthy bucket. That no. makes... That makes... That hey, makes... I have soap now. That makes... That makes... That makes... That makes... I'm not waiting. Mm-hmm. Ow. Ew. Now the sponge smells like dead rat. I don't wanna Wait. What should I do with it? I don't <laughs> I don't That's so weird and disgusting and I gross. Don't... Wait, can we put it I don't in wanna... the pipe? No. How about we put a slot? Yes. Okay. You just wait, Murray. You just wait. Murray! Come here, you gotta see this! What the... Oh, God! What the hell happened here? Man, what the hell is that stench? I told you, it's absolutely inhumane! I'm gonna get sick if you don't let me out already. All right, all right. I just didn't think... Hey, get out of here, you stupid cat. Murray, I don't think I can take it anymore. All uh -oh. right, all right, I hear you. Someone's gonna I die. you've learned your lesson. Let's get you out of here. Okay, listen to me, prisoner. We won't be throwing you in there for the moment, but that doesn't change anything. I don't like your attitude, and I won't let you spend the days just wandering around. What do you mean, Murray? Here, problem cases like you have to contribute something. Bruno's in charge of the kitchen, Boggs is in charge of the laundry, and you... You're gonna be the new gardener. Oh, great. Oh, Wasn't okay. there a more boring job? I want to be a guard on one of the watchtowers with a rifle or something. You will do what you are told, kid. All right. And what the hell am I supposed to do? Well, first we need to know if you got what it takes. Go to the field, there's some tools there, and here are some seeds. Go grow something. If tomorrow we see that you've managed it, the job's yours. Tomorrow? Ah, uh, I'll try, but I don't know anything about growing plants outdoors. What's that supposed to mean? Uh, it means <laughs> I'll do my best. We I don't want to disappoint you, Murray. boy. Show me you're capable of growing something, and you can be the new permanent gardener. I'll even give you the key to the tool chest. All right, let's do this. Okay. Whew, finally. I managed to get out of that filthy hole, and now I have one of the four ingredients I need to make the bomb. That tank Sleazy mentioned yesterday would certainly come in handy, but I don't think he'll have it. Well, wouldn't hurt to check. Okay, let's see the thief first. Morning, buddy. Hey. You're taking one too many liberties with me, rookie. Do you think you're one of the tough guys now just because you spent your first night in the hole? God, <laughs> I just said morning. Yeah, fuck you, asshole. Did you forget about our little conversation just before they threw me in the hole? Hey, I think I would remember something like that. Okay, I just want to make sure. Okay. Do you know where I can get some cooking oil, some fertilizer, or a bunch of matches? Get the hell out of here before I crack your head open with my, uh, with my, uh, where the hell's my crowbar? Don't ask me. Ah, oh, shit. I gotta get myself a new crowbar. Yeah, good luck with that. You still here? I thought I made myself clear. I'm going, I'm going. Mm hmm. I have I don't think I... Okay, let's see those guys here. The cat! Ah, crap. I think that damn can is just following me around. That's not good. How's it going? Hey, look, guys. It's Randy the Rookie. Come on, say hello to Randy. Hi, Randy. Hi, Randy. Hey, guys. We're just practicing. Sounds good. So, Randy, we hear you've been a naughty boy. <laughs> oh, because of the whole incident? 
No, because you didn't eat up all your veggies. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's nothing, actually. I just told Murray to stay out of my way and he wouldn't listen to me. Man, you are tougher than we thought. Yeah? You should see me on the phone to customer service. Now that is a badass. Hey, that's our Randy. You want to spit with us? No thanks, but, uh... Okay. I'm looking for some cooking oil, a bunch of matches, and some fertilizer. You guys got any of those things? What the hell is fertilizer? Um, well, how can it's I shit. put this? Manure. Shit. Hey, are you calling us pigs or something? Uh-uh, I would never. I think you came to the wrong place, rookie. But maybe Sleazy could help you with the matches. Okay, I'll talk to him. Okay. What's the point in spending the whole day spitting? I mean, do you actually get any better by practicing? You know, the only one that has any real chance of winning the big tournament is Bruno. So, how come he's not practicing too? He's been real busy in the kitchen. He broke his helper's arm, so now he has twice as much work. Which makes him twice as angry. You betcha! Great. You sure you don't want to join us, Randy? No thanks, guys. Guys, <laughs> I think you're scaring Randy. He don't want to play with us no more. Oh. Ah. Oh. Oh. Sorry, guys. I gotta go. See you around. See you, rookie. Okay. Nah, I don't. The cat. No That's way. Fine. I'm not gonna pet an animal that knows the date of my death. <laughs> I'm not gonna waste it. Okay, we got nothing with these guys. Let's talk to Sleazy. Goddamn cat is following ah, you me. you stupid cat. Will you leave me alone already? Uh oh. Let's talk to the thief. I don't think I... Okay. Let's talk to the prisoner. Hey, how come you're not eating? What's it to you, rookie? Get lost. I was just worried about your nutritional needs. Go bother someone else. Not in the mood. What's the deal with that pink bottle? What about it? Uh, no, nothing. I'm just curious. What the hell is it? Because it doesn't look like a strawberry milkshake. It's an acid, rookie. You happy? Now fuck off! No, I meant the composition. Why don't you check on the label? No. Okay, I'll do it then. May I? No freaking way. Come on, man. It would really be helping me out. Hey, you're just a fucking newbie. What part of fuck off don't you understand? I'll be <laughs> back. Do you by chance have any cooking oil or fertilizer? Are you fucking kidding me? Um, <laughs> no. <sighs> what can I say? No, I don't have any. Now fuck off. You good for nothing. Hey, watch your tongue, rookie. Or you might lose it. My tongue? Among other things. Ew. I better, I better go. go. Yeah, you better. Get out of here. Okay. We're talking. Oh, there's a new guy here. He looks scary. Let's talk to Sleazy. Hey, what's up, Sleazy? Well, well, well. If it isn't the rookie. I hear you spent your first night in the hole. Did you enjoy yourself? I bet you'd like to go back. No, trust me. I wouldn't. Listen, rookie. If I was you, I'd go hide in the deepest, darkest corner of this place and never come out. Listen, my friend, Randall Hicks is no coward. Well, the looks of you is telling me something else. What is that supposed to mean? It means be careful with the sisters. I hear they're kind of pissed at you. In fact, they want your head on a spike. <laughs> <laughs> just kidding, rookie. No one wants your head. I was just messing with you. But maybe it'd be a good idea to stay away from certain individuals. Uh, thanks. By the way... There's something different about you. Different? What do you mean? Nothing's changed around here. So, Eyeball. I guess you're still good at getting stuff, right? You guessed correctly. What do you need? Well, I need a few things. Mall ears, rookie. What is it? Mm. I need some cooking oil, some matches, and some fertilizer. Piece of cake. You'll have them all by tomorrow. Oh, never mind then. I would forgotten all about that detail. Hey, I know what's going on. You've started smoking again, haven't you? Again? I never quit since I came here. And, uh, don't you think that's a disgusting habit? 
You should try nicotine gum. That's way healthier. It's a good idea, but I don't have any nicotine gum. It's the only thing I can't get, and it's so frustrating. I did quit smoking before I was put in here, but I couldn't deal with the pressure, and I ended up giving in again. Well, this might be a good moment to try quitting. What really bothers me is that I'd actually gotten used to the flavor of that gum. I'd even started liking it. Well, this must be your lucky day, my friend, because I might be able to get you some. Seriously? Sure. You were going to get me a tank, right? So now we're even. A tank? Okay. But you'll have to wait till tomorrow. That's okay. I'm sure you could offer me something in exchange. Yeah, sure. <laughs> okay, we need I nicotine gum for this guy. I just remembered I had a dentist appointment. Really? Rather you than me. I'm booked in for a massage. Yeah, right. Ooh. Okay, let me save this. Just in case. Oh my god, we saved so many. Alright. Okay, continue. Box guy. Huh. Hey, you're new, aren't you? Me? No way! I've been here for a while now. I just prefer not to draw any attention to myself. That makes two of us. I'm Martin, by the way. Hey, Martin. I'm Randall. <laughs> Would you like to see a magic trick, Randall? You're gonna freak out. Um, I don't know. Come on, man. You mm -hmm. just have to give me something you don't need I'm anymore. I'm ready to see it. I'll make it it's not a problem. Why does it have to be something I don't need anymore? Because the magic box will dematerialize it forevermore. That sounds like a pretty stupid magic trick. We won't know for sure until we try, right? Um, I don't have anything I want to get rid of. I always end up growing fond of my garbage. I'm sure you must have some junk you don't need anymore. But anyway, if you don't want to enjoy the power of magic, that's your problem. Okay, then I'm just going to get out of here. See ya. Hey, come on, wait. Don't be like that. Dude, what the hell do you want? You know, it's just that everybody ignores me. Nobody wants to enjoy mm. my magic. Oh, I guess that's because you're not exactly David Copperfield. Oh, come on. Don't make me beg you. Please, I need to share my gift with the rest of the world. Sure. Okay. I just thought of something. Well, what if you give me something in exchange? After all, I'm going to lose one of my items forever if I let you do your stupid trick. So, you're saying that I have to give you something in exchange for letting you enjoy my amazing magic trick? Are you crazy? Okay, well, I have plenty of stuff to do, so if you'll excuse me. <laughs> God damn it! Wait! Yes? All right, you win. I just don't know what I have to offer you, my friend. Well, I can make the most out of almost anything. Okay. I'll give you my magic medallion. What do you think? Magic? Why is it magic? Where did you get that from? Well, it was lying around somewhere, and then... It suddenly appeared in my pocket. <laughs> Magic! I think you and I aren't as different as I first thought. You like burying people alive, too? Um, oh my god, I no. I take that back. So, deal? Alright, when I find something I don't need, I'll bring it to you and you can give me your magic medallion. Better yet, you'll be totally amazed by some kick-ass magic trick, and then I'll give you my medallion. Uh, sure. Whatever. By the way... Do you know where I can get some oils, some fertilizer, or a bunch of matches? Um, I don't have any of those things. And if I did, I would make them disappear with my box. You know me. Actually, no. But whatever. Anyway, I think you got it wrong, my friend. If you need someone to get you stuff, Sleazy is your man. I know, but I need that stuff like right now, and anything you ask Sleazy for won't be here till tomorrow. And I might never see that. How come? Are you gonna kill yourself or something? No, it's just that... Hey, why the hell am I still talking to you? Because you like me. And you just love magic. Yeah, sure. <laughs> gotta go. I gotta go. Okay, but remember, if you ever fancy being dazzled by the mysterious art of illusionism, you know where to find me. So what then? Are you a magician or are you an illusionist? Because it's not the same, you know that, right? I, uh, I think I like illusionist better. Okay, illusionist. I'm out. 
Okay. Got a lot of information from this guy. Oh my god, the cat is following me. No way. I'm not gonna pet him. Okay. Uh, we have some. Wait, we have huh. some seeds. We have some seeds. We can throw it on this. Okay. That's good. Well, I hope something grows, but I'm not holding my breath. We need. Uh, purified. Well, here. Yeah. I, think the I cat... don't want anything to do. Hmm. We need water. It's already. Okay. Can't get anything from here. We have to go inside. Murray! Hey, uh, Murray. How's your head? Yeah, good one, kid. You think hitting guards is funny? You know, next time you don't like the Sunday movie, just put it in writing, okay? Or you'll be spending a whole week in the hole. And don't say I didn't warn you. The Sunday movie? Oh, yeah, I get it. And, uh, what cinematic masterpiece was that? You're unbelievable. After all the trouble you caused, you don't even remember the movie? Damn brain-rotted kids of today. Yeah, but you didn't answer my question. Ah, uh, I can't remember. That one with the robot that goes around on his motorbike everywhere. Terminator? Yeah, that's right. Terminator 3. <laughs> it was on sale. Terminator 3? And there wasn't a riot? Bah! People complained a little, but nothing compared to your reaction. You should have seen them when they saw Meet Joe Black a couple of years ago. <laughs> we had some serious problems then. I'll just say that us guards weren't really prepared for it. We just weren't. What happened? Just imagine, screaming prisoners strangling each other, blood all over the place. Ooh. I even saw a guy jam a spoon in his eye. Here, oh my you God. see things, things you'd wish you'd never see. Wow, Murray, this place has turned you into a tough guy, huh? Yeah, that's what happens when you have to spend the day surrounded by the worst of the worst, the dregs of society. Thieves, murderers, rapists, you know. This place really does change, people. Yeah, it sure does. Okay. I hope you're still not mad at me. Uh, you know, the other prisoners made me do it. Forget about it, kid. I'm a hothead. Yes, you uh, proved that to everyone. Who made you do it? I can't tell you that, Murray. You know the rule about snitches. I'd never make it through the day in one piece. I understand. Anyway, here's a tip. Don't let the others push you around, kid. If you don't stand up to them, they'll just keep coming at you. Next time they try something like that, just man up and face them. Nah, I'm more of a running and hiding type of guy. But thanks for the tip. Okay. Do you know where I can get some cooking oil or a bunch of matches? Oil? Matches? What the hell are you up to? Uh, nothing, nothing. Uh, don't you worry, Murray. Mm. <laughs> Do you know why the hell this cat is suddenly following me around? Well, that's not a very good sign. What do you mean? You see, that cat has been around here for a few years now. And whenever he approaches someone, it's because that someone is about to die. Somehow, that cat has the ability to smell death. What? It's true. You know, there used to be a death row here, and every time the cat approached a guy, he was the next one to be executed. Coincidence? Kind of spooky, right? Well, <laughs> either that, or the warden had a very dark sense of humor. Okay, then. Just tell him to stop following me. Ah, I'm not in control of people's fate. And don't get too close to me from now on, okay? Great. Just great. Just what I needed right now. Well, I'm out of here, Murray. See you around. Go! Get out of here! <laughs> this goddamn cat. It's following me everywhere! I need to run. Hey, I see something. Nicotine gum. Doo -doo 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 -doo. I have nicotine gum. Hey, let's talk to Carl here. What's up, go. man? Hey, what's up, bro? How you doing with the nicotine gum? I made sure you had a couple of packs in your cell. Great. Uh, thanks for that, by the way. I know that gum ain't go for what tobacco does, but believe me, the day the cigarettes run out, you and me will be the kings of this prison. Yeah, if you say so. 
Sure, man. All we gotta do is play the waiting game. Trust me. Okay, so, uh... Do you know where I can get some cooking oil? Well, I guess there must be some oil in the kitchen. Although... Mm -hmm. Although... Bruno will be there, too, and that guy is bad news. You might get yourself into some serious beef. Eh, I'm sure we'll end up being good friends. No, I'm serious, bro. Don't go fucking with Bruno. That guy has absolutely no sense of humor. Okay, I'll be careful. It's just that I really need that stuff. And I really need a good lawyer. But I have to settle for what I got. I see you take things pretty easy, huh? That's how I roll, man. Uh -huh. Alright, see you around, Carl. Sure, bro. Okay, we got... I don't think... Oh, we got that this nicotine gun. There's nothing here obvious. Okay. Oh, the goddamn cat. Good morning, Bruno. What's for lunch today? Something yummy, I hope. But who do you think you are to just burst into my kitchen like that? Uh, oh, what do you mean? Uh, uh, I was... I don't want to see your dog ugly mug in my kitchen again. You hear me? Hey, relax. I just thought I'd... Get out of here! Don't make me say it twice. Okay, okay. Okay, he's not happy. The cat, that is a bird. Go eat it. Hey, Brooks. How you doing, kid? Well, can't complain. Cocaine. I told you, son. You should stay away from drugs. If you don't behave, they're going to send you straight back to the hole. Thanks for the tip, Brooks. You're welcome. Can I help you? Well, now that you mention it, yes. Oh, my God. Do you know where I can find some cooking oil? No, kid. The port is pretty far from here. The port? That doesn't even rhyme, Brooks. I can give you permit A38 if you want. What the hell are you talking about? New permit B65? I don't believe this. How come nobody told me about it? Yeah, that's what I wanted to know. Snow? <laughs> I don't think we'll see any this year. Yeah. Well, my friend, I'll leave you to your books. Yes, my name is Brooks. I thought you knew that already. I don't think my... Okay, this guy is not so. Forget oh, the it. I don't want him to peck my. Okay. I have to go. Th I think we have to leave this. No way. Okay. Let's go give the net nicotine uh, gum to Sleazy. Sleazy the man. Sleazy. Wait. Wait. Can I talk to him? No time for. Wait. Pillow. Uh, pillow without the. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. I thought there was something, but no. Come here. We have to give Sleazy nicotine gum. Well, here's your nicotine gum, just as promised. Hey, <laughs> awesome. I can offer you a cigarette and a match in exchange. Deal? Deal. All right. Here you go then. A cigarette and a match. Good. Thanks. Here's your gum. Maybe I'll have some more tomorrow. Okay. Uh, I'll... Okay. Wait. I think... This is bad tobacco. Just perfect for... How about if I... Lit a match here. Yes. The smoke will let the wasp go away. That's it. Get out of here, you damn done things. It. Finally. And don't come back. Finally, finally, finally. Okay. What is the hose? I know the hose. The hose. We can... Faucet. Okay. I can't do anything without the valve. What is the goddamn valve? <gasps> Is it the horseshoe? Doesn't fit there. Doesn't fit. Goddamn valve! There's a ball. I don't think. Nobody told me there is a valve. I don't. We have a soap. That makes no. I can't. 
until I get the water running. God damn it. Now what? I don't want to. This is. Hmm. That's not. Already got some. Mm-hmm. I don't want to ruin such fine work. It's already. Okay, where would I get the valve? Now? Get Shit. Let's see the box guy. Can give him pass. I need to pass. I need to find something for his stupid magic trick. Oh, so it will tell me if there is something. Okay. He doesn't. What if I give him a cigarette? I'd rather keep. Why you want to keep a cigarette? I don't think that. <laughs> I don't. <th> <coughs> I don't think that I'm not You're not giving, you're not doing. I'd rather I'd rather I'm not No. Okay, we need like a god. I better leave him alone. I'd rather. Oh shit! Let's let him in. I'm checking if there is a, a valve somewhere I can get, but no. No. I better not. I don't want any problems with. Okay, Bruno is an odd case. So. How about this guy? Can I give him the book? What for? Ah. <sighs> Can I give the bird smoke? How about this guy? I'd rather. I don't want to. Eat. <laughs> you don't see anything here. I can't do. Th Mm-hmm. I can't. <sighs> no. Oh my god, guys, we have to end our gameplay for today. My finger hurts from pointing and clicking everywhere. I hope you enjoyed my gameplay today. If you want to watch more, please, please do subscribe. Give me a thumbs up. Thumbs up, reach out my video, leave a comment, and definitely I will see you back again in my next gameplay. Enjoy, and game on. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. You can go. My finger hurts. Mm -hmm. Bye. <laughs> Hey gamers, my name is Hovak and you have reached my gaming channel. I hope you're gonna enjoy your stay here. You can watch all of my amazing gameplays. So please, please do subscribe, give me a thumbs up, enjoy your day, enjoy this site, enjoy this channel, and don't forget, enjoy my gameplays! And don't go out without subscribing! Give me a thumbs up and game on! Yeah!